everyone. This is Miss Finn here from the Literacy Lab, and today we're going to be reading It Wasn't Me, A Fantastic Funny Canine Caper by Lucy Barnard and illustrated by Hannah Wood. Oscar and Ella were mischievous twins who'd never take the blame. It wasn't us, they'd shout. It was Patch, they'd always claim. But Ella and Oscar's mom and dad weren't foolish, and they knew that Patch the dog was not to blame. It really wasn't true. When Oscar's mom invited her snooty friends over for lunch one day, splat! Oscar's ball landed in a cake and scared them both away. Oscar said, it wasn't me, it was Patch that kicked the ball. I don't think so, cried mom, marching Oscar down the hall. Dad was busy painting when Ella whizzed past him. Whoosh! She made the ladder wobble and Dad fell into the bush. Ella said, it wasn't me, Patch really wanted us to race. But she quickly disappeared when she saw Dad's grumpy face. When mom baked a chocolate cake and put a strawberry on top, Oscar only meant to take one piece, but he just couldn't stop. You greedy boy, cried mom, you'll get a tummy ache. Oscar said, it wasn't me, it was Patch that stole the cake. Ella just loved to run and twirl. She'd race around and jump and leap. But when she slipped in the vegetable patch, she landed in a heap. Ella said, it wasn't me. Patch chased the neighbor's cat. Oh no, said dad and shook his head. I'm not falling for that. One day, Oscar and Ella were building castles at the beach. But as they dug the moat, they heard a sudden screech. The sand was in mom's hair and on dad's ice cream cone. Oscar said, it wasn't us. Patch was burying his bone. Back at home, mom sighed. There's only one thing we can do. You're right, said dad as he crouched down. Come over here, you two. Your mom and I have had a chat. We both agree. And so, if all these things are Patch's fault, then... He'll just have to go. Ella said, you can't get rid of him. He's such a lovely pet. We both love Patch, said Oscar, feeling guilty and upset. They told the truth and asked their mom and dad if Patch could stay. On one condition, said dad. No more telling lies, okay? The next day, Patch was playing. But he slid on the rug and crash! He slammed into the table and mom's vase fell with a smash. Oscar wailed. Patch really did do that, but mom must never know. Ella said, you're right, or she might say that Patch will have to go. So Oscar and Ella took the blame as mom cleared the mess away. Then they helped around the house, doing boring jobs all day. Ella looked over at Oscar as they dusted the bookcase. Had they really seen a crafty little grin on Patch's puppy face? The end! Thanks for reading along with me. I hope you enjoyed this story about the importance of telling the truth. See you next time. Bye!